Hello everyone, hope you guys are doing well. We are back with our Gunlooper game series. Um, so, pretty much in Hyper, but with guns. If you do enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already. Leave a comment if you like as well. I really, really do appreciate it. So, we're over in the Trapper's Cabin at the moment. Very familiar. We spent so much time here in the last um, series that we did. I do have a bunch of books. Um, I have 36 cat's tails. We have some uh, peaches and stuff here. But um, we also have rifle ammo, which I'm gonna take because I think if I find a revolver, then, you know, awesome. But I really would like a, obviously, rifle. That would be so much better. I really also need to try and get some bunnies or some food. Our health isn't super great at the moment, so that's like not super good. But there are no bunnies over here. I'm curious because I don't know. I think I have a hacksaw. And I would like to know if the bear is actually in his cave over that way because outside of the bear cave that way there is normally a bunch of bunnies. So if the bear isn't there then I might try and get myself some bun buns if they're there. <laughs> if they're not then it's gonna suck but let's have a look and hopefully Mr. Bearo isn't here. Oh, little doe. I want to go a little bit. Should I waste a stone? I'm not sure there's a bear there. Maybe he's spawning somewhere else for this series. Oh, having a gun right now would be so good. I need to find food. Yeah, maybe he's not spawning here this series. Okay, and I guess that's a sort of plus, but also not really such a plus. Next plan is it's actually not that cold at the moment, which oh my gosh we actually got snow here and it was so beautiful but it lasted for like a day <laughs> i mean oh, okay it wasn't even really a day but like it snowed for quite a few hours and it was just so pretty it was so nice went for a walk in it and it was just i love snow because it's literally everything sounds so like dead silent like, if you go out in the snow, it's just silence. It's so nice. It is so nice. So, I think what I'm going to do is, I believe the Wilderness Kitchen one is one that we should read first off. So, I'm going to try and do two hours of this. Until we get, um, tired. And I did want to go into the cave and get some coal. I believe we now have a lantern. Die if I don't get some food oh yeah, soon. here it is. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm going to drop off. Oh, I have a lump of coal here. Some stuff that is like the heaviest. Why do I have so many sticks on me? So many sticks. Um, cat's tails as well. I mean, they'll be good for Tinder just for the time being. Um, I'll drop like that many. And then I will also drop that. And I'll keep, oh my gosh, Priva. Yeah, so we have like one lump of coal. Oh, I have a couple of lumps of coal there as well. 
Um, oh, we have another hacksaw here. And firearm kits, they're not actually supposed to spawn, right? In Because I didn't change anything about the loot tables. Like, apart from the fact that we were allowed to have guns. And obviously I took what the amount of feats. But that is literally the only thing that I did different to, like, a normal, like, interloper run. So, I don't know why the gun kits... Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Um, yeah, I don't know why the gun kits have decided to show up. Because I'm pretty confident that they shouldn't be showing up. Um... Because I think that was the purpose of uh, the comment I mentioned about doing a Gunloper series in the first place. Mentioned that the challenge would be, at least I'm pretty sure it was that obviously no gun cleaning kits would spawn. So you would have to go to one of the two places with the Timberwolves and the milling machine to be able to, you know, repair your gun. So I'm kind of confused as to why the gun cleaning kits have been spawning and I'm torn because when I eventually find a gun I don't know whether to allow myself to use the gun cleaning kits or whether to just pretend that they're not there and have to go to like the milling area. I don't know. Let me know in the comments because obviously at the moment I still have not... Is there something around here? Yeah, at the moment I have not, um, what is round here that's making it go like this? Anyway, I, yeah, uh, we've not found a gun or anything yet, so we're a little bit far away from even doing that. So I'm not going to worry too much about it at the moment, but I'm just torn whether I actually use them or whether... I pretend they're not there. Pretty much, that is pretty much all I was getting at. Yeah, I'm just grabbing these so I've got some extra snacks. I don't know if I will ever go to Mountain Town. I mean, I'd like to say at the moment, my kind of like big priority is A, finding a gun, and then I would absolutely love to head back to the airstrip because I did the video where we died there twice and I left a couple of videos go or in the last episode or the episode before that I can't remember um but we left pretty soon just because I think that was the best choice I really do think it was the best choice um I hope I'm right <laughs> but we will definitely go back is there another one down here at all I don't want to miss any okay right I don't see any so I'm just gonna head it all the way back um, through the cave and I'm gonna eat some stuff and sleep in the trapper's cabin and then we're gonna move off probably to the mystery lake cabin let's see if there's a gun around there if there isn't then I might go and have a look in the tower because I think sometimes I've had a gun spawn up there I obviously I don't know where things are spawning or what has changed about different spawning things just from what I remember from previous games but it's probably changed so. oh also I completely forgot that we don't even have a bedroll at the moment so okay bedroll is also very important I need a bedroll <laughs> I can't believe I forgot about the bedroll need a bedroll need a gun um yeah I just need to start like doing some stuff to harvest things and get our skills up I have a feeling I might get a wee bit of cabin fever risk but it's okay yeah, I don't think that the bear is actually in that cave this time, which I'm glad, but also it's not going to be an easy bear hunt for us. I also keep forgetting that me playing on like a custom game doesn't, as far as I'm aware, I very highly doubt that they changed it, but it doesn't increase your feats as you do stuff. So if I manage to snare any bunnies or however many fires I manage to start, in this series it's not going to go towards my feats which it sucks but I'm going to have another game <laughs> um, going probably just like a Voyager game off camera or something like that. I am also very 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 tempted 
for us to load up a pilgrim game. I think I said this before, but to load up a pilgrim game and just, you know, mooch around the new area and have a real good look. Okay, so this is going for an hour and a minute. I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to add two lumps of coal and we're going to research this for an hour. I should probably make a note of what I have left here, but it's okay. So that's 77. This. this is 88. I'm going to drop the 77 one. And we're going to stick that there. We have a fair amount of water. I'm going to bring this with us just because we need to read it. That's pretty damaged. I'm going to drop off this tin. Um, we still have some of those. I have some leather. I'm going to take that with us. I'm going to drop off two of those. Have some rose hips. The revolver I'm also going to take with us. The firearm cleaning kit. I'll take and I might just drop it off in the next cabin. Okay. Right. Um, should I drop some tea here? Like some property? I have a bit of a sewing kit. Right, let's go before I hang about here too long. <laughs> too long, too long. So, where we're going next is going to be the camp office very clear as I said I don't believe that the bear is over here so we could probably take that little bit of a shortcut to get over here I don't know how many matches I have either I obviously was not paying attention yeah I don't believe that berry boy is over here there is a deer though. Oh, we need a gun. Because that'll be a good hunting spot actually. If the deer and the doe, at least I think they're doe, keep spawning there. Then if we do have a gun, we could obviously get them. I was down this way. Oh, if I see any more birch, I've got to take it as well. Yeah, and then that cave is empty. There's a wolf there, though. That's fine. It's all good. Unless the bear is, like, all of a sudden up here now, in which case that's not so good. The question is, do I go to... Okay, we'll hop down here. Do I go to the cabin? Oh, I also found some... I don't think it was maple. But that's the other thing. Do I even bother with crafting a bow in that, seeing as we're allowing ourselves to have guns? Like, if I do it, would I be doing it just because? As, like, a emergency up. thing for if the gun needs repairing and I am not near the repairing station? Okay, now I see bunnies. Okay. Oh, a cooking pot and another wilderness kitchen. Yes, please. Uh, Could end up being useful. I'm gonna leave that one there, but I'm gonna take that and I'll also take the charcoal. Oh, we'll take these rose hips too. Should be straightforward from here. So cold. I know, but just want to lay down for a bit. Let me know in the comments if you guys have had snow wherever you're from. <laughs> it like very rarely snows in the UK. Like it's not something where it's just like every winter we're like guaranteed snow. I we don't know if we actually had any last year. I don't think we did at all. But this year we had a little bit and it might have just been a day's worth, but I'm happy about it. <laughs> I'm happy about it. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. 
Look at the cute little dog. I wonder how much meat they have on. I feel like they'd have less meat than the actual deer. I think that would make sense, right? Because aren't they the female version? Or are they the male version? I can't remember. I don't know. I don't even know what, who I'm kidding. I literally do not know. <laughs> like, literally do not know. Okay, right. Let's pop this down before I accidentally use a match. Making ourselves a bunch of teas. Getting inside somewhere warm. Oh, cool, a whetstone. Yes, please, I need this to repair. Okay, this place has a gun. I would be very happy with that. Oh, wait, no. Were those antibiotics? Where were you in the... Yep, we're taking all of them. We're taking all of them. What else have we got? Anything that's hidden? I know what this game is like with, like, hiding stuff under stuff. Oh, we have a tin. And we have a book there. I think it's a shooting guide book. Yeah, a frontier shooting guide. Uh, maybe I will read that at some point, but I feel like for the moment, my... Oh, hello. The reading the books for the wilderness kitchen and stuff like that are going to be a high priority before any of the gun books. I'm not awful with the guns, but I'm not, you know, I'm not great. <laughs> I'm not great with any type of weapon in this game. But it's all good. Um, I don't see any food food. I did leave the peaches um, back at the trapper's place. Could be a downfall, but... Oh, a summer soda. Yum. I can also tear up all of that, because we can do that with our bear phalanges. There's always a tin here. <laughs> like it. Okay, I don't see anything. More matches as well would not be a miss. Okay, I do not see the gun around here unless I am literally um, blind. <gasps> Bedroll! Yay! Okay, cool. That's one thing ticked off of our bucket list. Bucket list? Whatever. To-do list. <laughs> we now have a bedroll, which is really good. So I'm just going to pop... Oh, wow. Okay. This place is very stocked out on pots. I might take this one with us then. Uh, still don't see anything under the beds. No firearms as of yet. I think but I can use this. What I do want to do is... I don't really want to just like sell in here as much as I would like to. I think what we need to do is I'm going to drop off all of the leather here um, and I'm also going to drop off all of the clothes that I'm not actually currently wearing. Is this one better? Uh, but useful when paired with a decent underlayer. Um, meant to protect from the wind and water has no real warmth value. So is that a good one to wear? I'm I'm gonna go with yes, I guess. This one. Or should we wear this one? Over top. Remains warm when wet. Okay, so we'll wear this on the outer layer maybe. Better for wind temperature. Okay, we'll just drop all of these. Oh crap, no. <laughs> I needed one of them. I think it was you. We'll wear that. Uh, I have no more of those, no more of those, no more of those. Uh, let's drop those ones. Scar See, I would have thought the scarf would have been better, honestly. Uh, we'll just drop that. Okay, yeah, so I'll drop all of these clothes here. And we will come back and I will probably, like, harvest them up. My... Oh, we'll also drop off these. 
My hat is pretty damaged, but I think that's okay. Um, I will take the pot with the- oh, okay, we really need to repair the bedroll. I do not see a sewing kit here, though, anywhere. Oh, I do have antibiotics. Um, let's drop off all of these, then, and let's drop off all of these. It's not much weight, but <laughs> it'll do. So, I don't know whether to go- I think I might, actually. I'm gonna also just drop this off here. I think if I find the gun, I'm going to allow myself, if, depending on how ruined the gun is, I'm going to allow myself to repair the gun up to its max. And then... Um, yeah, I don't see it anywhere. Up to its max from the... Oh, cute little Christmas tree. And then maybe set myself a rule where I'm not allowed to use a gun repair kit after maybe like X amount of days or something like that. Okay, repair skill increased. That's fine. Okay, right. The weather is slightly clear. It's so beautiful. Did I tell you that I found out how to take actual screenshots? <laughs> I did. I know I did. I Trying to be funny. No, we're go we're gonna go up here. Hopefully, I can make it. Hopefully, it isn't too windy and there's not too many wolves this way. What's this? Nothing. Yeah, I would really like to make it up here. I just really would like to find the gun. If I can't find it up here, then the next place for me to check would be the cabins over there before I even ventured off to the dam. I don't think that the dam would honestly have anything in it, but you never know, right? I could get some of these bunnies on my way back. That would help with my harvesting skill and such. So maybe we will do that. I don't know if I will start a fire in the place up here, the lookout tower. I could do, but I don't know if I will do. I didn't realize though, like, it saves the screenshots to my desktop. <laughs> so when I play the long dark for a little while and I back back out, literally my desktop is just full of screenshots. <laughs> I don't know if you can change it, but if you can, I might. I do like my desktop to look clean. Look at that, it's just so orange and beautiful. Okay, forestry lookout. Let's go up here. As I said, I don't know if I will start a fire, depends how cold it is up here or whatnot. So I do have some rifle rounds and everything like that. Um, the dam is over there. Cabin is there. I may just spend the night here. It might mean that I have to eat the cattails, but honestly... Let me have a look, see if there's anything out here. I honestly thought that was a flag gun then. Oh, okay, so there's a pry bar. I mean, I've already got one, but sure. It's dusk, so night can't be Okay, so the gun is in here. But once again, we are finding some more ammo. There's a gun cleaning kit. Ah, okay. This kind of changes things because I was really hoping for there to be a gun over here. There's ketchup chips though. That'll come and handy. the small firearms thing. Oh, okay, summon kit. Is there nothing? I'm gonna survey. First place we have surveyed in Mystery Lake. Nice. I... Mm, I don't think I have enough stuff here. Okay, what I'm gonna do... I'm gonna eat the chips. I'm gonna drink what water we can. 
It's so frustrating that there isn't a gun here. Oh my gosh. I'm finding all the ammo. I hope I'm just not like oblivious and missing it all the time. Okay, um, let's sleep for only four hours. It's not going to do us much good, but I need to make some water. So I think I might start a fire up here. We really don't have a lot of water. Wait, what did it- Oh my gosh, it was unsafe. I'm a complete and a freaking idiot. I thought it would be enough. Okay, whatever. We have unsafe water on us now, so we need to- No, no. Oh. Guys. <sighs> Wasted two matches. I'm going to have to go to those cabins. We're going to those cabins right now. I feel like I'm also just going to try and make a run for it. And avoid any wolves along the way. Maybe if I could get some bunnies that would be... Oh gosh, don't go down there. That would be fabulous. But honestly, I'm going to grab another stone. Yeah, the bunnies, grabbing the bunnies would be fabulous because not only would it give us guts so and hide curing, it would also give us the obvious rabbit. If all else fails, I can go into the ravine and try and get the bunnies there, which I think I might possibly do. Oh, come on, that hit it. I refuse. These bunnies gave me trouble last time. They g they gave me a lot of trouble last time. Can't feel my hands. Okay, I'm gonna settle for one. So clear. Yeah, I found no matches so in the cold. in this cabin. Which sucks tremendously. I think what I might have to do is go around that way. So that I avoid the wolf. So let's get inside and harvest this bunny so that we can get the guts in that curing. Um... We'll do small amounts and I'm gonna obviously use my hands. Bunny meat looks really horrible now. <laughs> like the the bunny meat look in your inventory looks really horrible. <laughs> oh for bunny. Poor bunny. It's like the weather just changes so quick when you go into an indoors area. I'm worried about where to go next. Should I just cook the bunny meat and eat it? And then sleep? Should I maybe create like an outdoor fire? Hmm. No, okay. We're gonna. We're gonna go inside. I really gotta find some new matches as well. But yeah, we're gonna cook this bunny meat. I might just eat it and then head on over to the other cabins. This is like my last ditch attempt sort of thing to get ourselves a rifle. Because in a couple of like previous games, not interloper games obviously, but um, other games, the rifle has also spawned at the back of the cabin over here. I had really high hopes that it would be inside the lookout tower. 
but unfortunately, no such luck. And we're getting kind of tired, so I don't want to. I don't want to just like sleep in the cabin. I want to at least try and. Get some more stuff done. If the bear is over here. Then. He's obviously not. Well I mean he's obviously not in the cave near the trapper's place anyway. We've like. We've discovered that already. So what I'm saying is. Utter useless information. <laughs> I don't see him. Okay. I believe I have all of the cat's tails from here. Let's head on. Head on over. Okay, fishing guide. We'll take it. Uh, maybe at some point we will obviously re Oh my gosh, more ammo. I'm <laughs> I'm like finding ammo, but we're still not finding an actual weapon. Come on, I have such high hopes for behind this building. Such high hopes. I got my fingers crossed. Oh my gosh, no! Oh man! Oh wait, a key? Wait, what? Uh, I can't stand the thing. There's plenty of MRAs down there in the dam. A broken. Not sure why I feel room. so tired. Oh, a memento cache. Okay, okay, okay. Memento key. Take it. Yeah. Sure, this is new. I've never seen this before. Um, okay. Yeah, I've never seen that before. Okay, we've got a new jacket. No pills. Gun? Is there a gun in here? <laughs> oh my gosh, the game is so stingy. <laughs> I honestly had such high hopes for us having like a gun by now. Maybe like too much high hope. But we just got a cache. It said about MREs but I don't know if there will actually be MREs down there. But now I'm like uber curious. We also found a cache in the Fallen Muskeg. Like I found the note to the cache. It was in the little... um. Is it a hunter's blind or something? The train cart that was broken. And that you can get inside and there's a barrel in there. In that um, place we found... What's dead over here? We found another note that was like talking about a cache and it pinged up on the map. But of course... Okay, yeah, I'm going to save the dead guy till last. I really need another torch or something. Right. Ammo. A rifle. No. I mean, I'd settle for more matches at the moment, seeing as I wasted like two in one go. That was really suckish. But I'm also going to have to sleep, so I'm just going to have to sleep in one of these cabins. It'll be fine. It'll be fine, it'll be fine. So I tell you what, before I do that, let me grab this. Let me search this dead guy. Of course he had nothing on him. Don't know what I was expecting. I'll take the feathers for like 
just in case. Because I feel like I may have to make a bow anyway. Um, let's search the second one. Yeah, I feel like I'm going to have to make a bow anyway. This is going to go out. Because it should be hanging up there, right? Table. Spray can. Utterly useless unless we can use it as like accelerant. <laughs> Oh gosh, okay. I am going to eat a cat's tail and just get into the next cabin. Get into this one. I can maybe try and trek over around the corner, but my guy is so tired. So, so tired. So then maybe I should survey the areas that I have searched. My gosh, there is nothing. Not even matches. Okay. So tired. Right. Right, right, right. I'm going to eat three. Eh, I'll just eat two. I mean, we've got some cool stuff. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to leave this episode here um, and then in the next one I will search the cabins around the other side and we will I'll probably maybe drop off some stuff in the lake cabin and then we will head straight for the dam because I'm curious about this like cash I don't know where it would be it said broken window I'm pretty sure that that's what it said. And we had it, we, we got this little key. So maybe there will be like a nice stash there, even on interloper. Um, or, you know, like interloper difficulty just with guns. We still haven't found a gun yet, but we do have a bedroll. Um, I'm slowly munching my way through my cat's tails, which is not super great. But yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching this episode. I hope you're enjoying it. As I said, I would really, really love to go back to the airstrip fairly soon but I really want a weapon <laughs> we're finding so much ammo and stuff but yeah hit the like button leave comments don't forget to subscribe if you have not already and I will see you all in the next video take care bye